unusual contest in Barnwell wrapped up tonight. Nine people had the chance to win a free car, but they had to work for it. The last person to take their palm off the car would win it. Ann Maxwell has the winner's story. What would you do for a free car? Leon Randall and Sierra Mosley have been here at B&B Ford for nearly three days for the Touch a Car contest. Whoever keeps their palm on the car the longest gets to take it home. No strings attached. We got 10 minutes. Their only relief is a 10 minute bathroom break every four hours. You've seen the other people drop out. Like, what's led to people's breaking points? Um, the restroom, one thing. Um, one lady had family issues. Um, other people got cold. Uh, people just got tired. Around 400 people entered a raffle to have the chance to even get in the competition. From there, 10 contestants' names were drawn, but only nine decided to participate. They need the car really bad, so I was like, heck yeah. <laughs> the competition started on Friday evening. On Monday evening, two were left, and both equally determined. I was also in the market for looking for a car because I don't have one at this time, just running. And uh, also, the same situation that he said. Both say they've received lots of support, and both say in the scheme of things, three days of braving the elements isn't that bad. I'm a volunteer fire firefighter for uh, Snellings, and I work with DOT, and I also work with the Hill House. Mosley says she's doing this for her kids. So I have three children. Well, one passed away, my oldest, which is Jalen Beasley. She's seven years old. Um, on the 19th, we've been her six months passing away. Um, she passed away from brain cancer. She says her car doesn't have any heat or AC, and she'd be okay riding around like that, but she wants better for her children. And she says the car's color, gray, is the color for brain health awareness. How we both born a car and we both need a car and that's the whole thing and that's what makes it tough about the whole situation and um but we're both supporting each other too so in the end they both won mosley's church ended up teaming together to buy her a new car and leon got to take home the taurus Congrats. So it had a happy ending. Both of them. Happy ending for both. And if that seems like something you would be interested in, the manager there at the dealership tells us they are planning to do another Touch the Car contest this winter.